Hello guys, in this uh, video I will talk about daemon thread in Java. So what does it mean by daemon thread? Daemon thread in Java is basically it's a service provider thread that provides service to the user thread. So what happens is whenever your user thread is running, like the thread which you have designed, uh, to run that thread you need to have you know some service provider. So this daemon thread will provide the service for that. And uh, this daemon thread uh, actually life depends on the mercy of user thread. Okay, if user thread will get die, this daemon thread will also die. So when all user thread dies, JVM will terminate the thread automatically. So JVM will terminate this daemon thread automatically. And basically this is a service provider thread which will help your thread to run. So there are uh, there are many Java daemon threads running automatically, which is nothing but garbage collection, finalizer etc. Right. So these are all daemon threads guys. I think you might be knowing that garbage collections but though you might be knowing that I will cover in my next topic. We will have a separate topic for garbage collection and finalizer. So these are the example of daemon thread. Uh, how this will help your thread is let's say your thread is running and your thread execution will get over. So this daemon thread will clean the object. Unreferenced object it will clean that. Right. So what are the points we need to know in the daemon thread. It provides service to the user thread for background supporting task. It has no role in the life than to serve user thread, right? It has only, I mean, the daemon thread role is only to serve the user thread. When the user thread is running, just serve that thread. It lives depends on the user thread. If your user thread will die, this daemon thread will get terminated by the JVM. It has very low priority. Okay, it has very low priority. There are some methods of daemon thread we need to know. So two methods. One is set daemon. We can make any thread as a daemon thread. Okay, by setting it true. And we can also, if some thread is running, uh, by calling is daemon method, we'll come to know whether particular thread is daemon thread or not. Now uh, we will try to understand with the example. So we'll create one example. We'll create one Java class. This class will extends thread. We'll write a run method. And here I will write if thread dot current thread dot each daemon. Right. If this is the case, just say that this thread is daemon thread. Else, you say this thread is not daemon thread okay now make a main method write a new operator here so we have created one object let me create some more object the object we have created now what I will do is I will do obj dot set daemon is equal to true I am going to make this thread as a true and then we will call a start method on all the objects okay so every object will call the run method right now uh, if I run this for one thread I should get this output for remaining thread I should get this output let me run that see if you look at the output here 
this thread is a daemon thread then not a daemon not a daemon right because for this thread i have made uh, this as a true so uh, we came to know that this is a daemon thread remaining two is not a daemon thread right so that's how daemon works and by calling this method we will come to know that whether it is daemon or not and we can set the thread as a daemon by by supplying a boolean true value to the set daemon method so with this we are done with daemon thread in java thank you guys thank you for watching this